Oh. Oh. That might go in. What are you hitting? Oh. Oh. Ow. What are you hitting? Clinton, dude. Have you hit these yet? What is it? This is the new TI Fusion. Ooh. The Apex TI Fusion from Callaway. Now, you know, I'm not a big Callaway fan. I know it. I know it. But you know I am. Yeah, you're a giant Callaway. But, bro. Soft. Soft. It, it's just butter. So it was interesting because old Apex, like Apex Pro was kind of clicky. Bro, last year, you know my opinion on that. Yeah. I did not like them. They were, they were clicky. They performed fine. Sure. You know, they went far. They did all the things right. And they but were forgiving. But again, the framing was a little off for me. Yeah. Bro, you have got to hit this like right now. Like right now. It, it. You're going to see what I'm talking about. When you set this iron down, it doesn't look like this, like, super, like, game improvement you know, type thing. I mean, but there's so much tech in this thing. That's it's crazy. interesting how little it looks. Yeah. Not a lot of offset. There is, there is noticeable offset, but not a lot of offset, but how thin the top line is. Yeah. That looks really good. Is that not the most beautiful iron you've seen from them in a while? Now, I remember Fusion from back in the day. Are these things just as hot? Oh, oh, just as hot, but dude, I'm telling you, softer. Ouch. That was a little thin, right? I was out of the heel, yeah. But you see what I'm saying? Even that, look at that miss. Yeah. It's on the green. That's the, that's the, that's the tie working for you, baby. Come on. That was off the toe. I guess I could have got you like a half inch over. Yeah. Would that have helped you? It's a little hard to reach for these, but it's okay. <clears throat> I just want to catch one. Dude, just wait. It, it's so soft and buttery. It's incredible. Like that. Come on, go in. See, yours is just like mine. It doesn't really leave the line. Yeah. So here's the thing I love about these so far, dude. And, and you're seeing this already. But notice how it doesn't just jump. Yeah. It's not like this freaky, like crazy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, absolutely. It, it, it's, it's, it's a normal number. Look at that one, baby. There's the Clinton 7-iron. About a 200-yard 7-iron for you. Feels really good. Do you I'm, see what I'm, I'm saying? You're I'm not, not a Callaway a, I'm guy. I'm not a Callaway guy. But how soft is that? Very, very soft off the face. Hmm. And does it get sexier than a black iron? No, it really doesn't. I mean, you know, I was actually reading up on these, dude. Yeah. So you have a ton of different shaft options. Okay. Okay. That are no upcharge. Okay. Now they only have a few that are blackout like that. You know, I would say if there was a downside, that would be it. But bro, can you imagine these? Now that one's a little lightweight for you for sure. But with my broken back, that helps me a ton right now. Yeah. Right. I, I can swing that a lot for easier sure. than you right now. But at 94 miles an hour or whatever you are like a freak show, can you imagine that iron with that KBS PBDS taper? Woo! Huh? Yeah. With that mirrored finish on it? Oh my gosh. Look at that thing. That feels fantastic. So, okay. Be honest. Be honest. Yeah. All the forgings that are out there. That's right up there, dude. Absolutely. From the, from the softer feel thing? That's up there, and it's got titanium in it. I will say, probably one of the softer. Yeah. Off the face. It's, when it's caught in the grooves, now that's relative, right? Because I don't catch it in the, the center of the, the head very often. When it's caught good, it may be Mizuno. Yeah. It's really soft. You know what? The first, the first club that came to mind, when I hit it, in the middle. The first thing that came to my brain was like Strixon slash Mira. Like okay. it had that kind of softness to yeah. it. But what I like about it versus the previous gen, dude, 
is when you hit it off the face, it's not clicky. Yeah. You absolutely. have feedback. You can feel the ball mushing. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. That's a big deal to me. Here's the other thing about this. See, here I am, Mr. Fanboy, right? But, dude, Golly. that iron, name a Callaway Tech from the irons in previous years. It's in there. Yeah, they've done basically, they've taken the conglomerate of technology they've had in the last 10 years and went. Titanium, tungsten, fusion, the fusion tech, which is that polymer tech, carbon mm -hmm. fiber microspheres, cup face tech. Come carbon on. Fiber microspheres, carbon fiber microspheres. Uh huh. But hold on. What? This isn't the only new Apex. Well, I'm glad you said that. You ready? Yeah. Look what else I brought in here. I was hitting the uh, AI 300, and then they also have the AI 200. Okay. Okay. Now, the whole heart behind this is you could blend the sets. Sure. So, like, you could go long irons here. You're going to have a little more offset in the three. more offset, for sure. Right? And then in the two, it's going to be, you know, still offset, but, you know, it'd be a great lower iron set. This like is a very DCB-ish. Yeah. AI yeah. 300. Hey, you know what? That's what they replaced DCB with. Look at that one. Are you kidding? See, that's more your length, too. Yeah. That's over. that half over. Yeah. And it's perfect right away. Do you, like, how does it feel to hit a seven iron 200 yards? It just makes me so mad. It is what it is, you know? You just, you get used to it. I mean, yeah, you're just so strong. <laughs> Whatever. I guess, Whatever. Now, here's the other thing. This shot here, I think this is a shot that a lot of people will see. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, this is a shot, a shot shape that people struggle with, That kind of that right cut. Yeah. But check it out, bro. Only 981 spin. And did you notice your back spin on that was only 5944? 59 so it's never going to overspin and get that floaty effect. So essentially, you're still going to have your number. For sure. Even on that miss hit. You know what I mean? It just doesn't have as much movement. Oh, baby. It's so embarrassing that I set the green at 180 and then you come in here and start hitting it 201. It just pisses me off. All right, there's AI 200. That's interesting. What do you mean it's interesting? If, okay, so there's not a lot of difference between catching maybe a little toey, a little heely to center. It feels unique or uniform pretty much across the face. Yeah. 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 I mean, honestly, dude, and I know I get it for you preference wise, right? Callaway's not been your favorite iron. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Just for you personally, but you can't argue the fact that they, they probably do it better than anybody else in the business. You know, as far as if you took the totality of, of product line, game improvement to players. Yeah. Callaway has such an amazing bead on what the public needs. Absolutely. They really do. I mean, the perimeter weighting and everything is just second to none. They're very in tune with the consumer. Yeah. Look at that shot. And see, you'll notice, too, your window doesn't change. That's why I say you can blend this set. Yeah. Your window doesn't change much between the 200 and the 300. So you don't, you know, you're not hitting two different balls. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Still 198 carry versus the 300. They're about the same number. That was one thing I loved what they did. They did change their loft specifications that much. Yeah. Where you have to go bending on them like crazy. That was real steep. And I did, dude, the other day, I, uh, I built a set for a, for a buddy uh, of, the, of the TI Fusion. Yeah. Or, um, excuse me, the AI 300. And guess what? Bend like butter. So they're very, very soft. That is something. I did bend a set of Fusions, and you just barely have to touch them on that Mitchell machine, and they... Yeah. Yeah. And they go right with... And you know what? Uh, I just want to point something out real quick. Do you know what your side spin was on that one? 
That ball didn't move. Zero. <laughs> yeah. So something that, that's going to get asked is on the 200, I would say on the 300, it's not very workable just because of how much offset there is. Correct. Um, but the 200 is remarkably less offset. I'm going to try to draw a ball. Um, start it out right, bring it back left. Okay. Oh, okay. You're so cool. <laughs> That's awesome, bro. So it's still, you can still, you can play still the ball move it, for right? Sure. Here's, here's what I love about it, dude. For, for so many people out there, I think one of the biggest things that happens is they come in, they want to buy something off the shelf, right? Yeah. Well, these come with the DG mid, which I don't have to tell you, but that mid shaft and our testing has been incredible. They have, they have a couple. Oh, you did the hold off cutter there. Look at that. What a puke. Unbelievable. Still you very workable. Miss? Still very workable. miss? Yeah. Spin went up. We were expecting more spin. Well, on a cut, yeah. for sure. But where I was going with that mid shaft is I think True Temper brilliantly came out with this shaft. Absolutely. I think this was a very needed shaft dynamic on the market. Because it focuses more of that, it's got more emphasis in the midsection sure. of the shaft. In a world where we're looking at more polarity, right? Sure. So more more tip heavy shafts or butt heavy shafts or even counterbalanced. These right here have a little more focus on that midsection. I think that's brilliant. Yeah. And it feels awesome. It's almost got like a modus feel to it. it does have a very modus -y feel. Yeah. You know what I mean? And again, I think True Temper had to bring this because they're competing with a very strong modus feel. Absolutely. That motor shaft is incredible. Yeah. And so True Temper had to come out with something to play in the market there. Mm -hmm. And they did a great job. And no no additional upcharges. You know, right. most of the companies are doing that now, as you yeah. know. But no additional upcharges here. And, and, can you imagine? I was telling you about that TI Fusion a minute ago with the money taper with that mirrored finish. Mm. Can you imagine this bad boy right here with like a Modus 120 in it? Yeah. Forget about it. It'd oh be my so gosh. Good. It would just be butter. It'd be Coming so off the it'd be butter. Yeah. There's three irons that you have to cut. These are available they're, they're here. now. I have them in component too. And we can build them out in-house professionally and per to precise numbers for you right now. You don't have to wait. You don't have weeks. to wait. You don't have to ship them off somewhere. You can get them right here, right now. Whatever shaft, whatever grip, whatever swing weight, whatever lie. You desire, you can get them right now. You, they need to come in here. You need to come in here right now and fit for these irons. The doorbell better ring right now. Right now, here it is. Come try some of these Apex irons.